Hi there. Look to your left. The key is in the ignition. Come on. From whence comes this? Don't argue with the lady. Get in. This chariot is fleet. It's not a chariot, Featherbrain. It's an SUV. The probes couldn't have gone far. They're on foot. Not anymore, they're not. Handles like a dream, doesn't it? Also, plenty of cargo space for your stolen loot. And don't even get me started on a cup holder. Let me just say I've had my eye on your operation for the last few days, and I'm really impressed with what I'm seeing. The whole costume villain team-up thing. It's very exciting. I'm thinking we could do something together. <laughs> yeah, he sounds funny. <laughs> Kind of an I scratch your back, you scratch mine type arrangement. Consider this slick ride a down payment. It's a truck. Big one. Push the red button. Nice option. Does that come standard with this model? Look, sweetheart, whoever you are, I'm the leader of this syndicate. The head honcho, the big cheese, see? And there's no way I'm letting you muscle in on- What if I told you that I had in my possession designs for a groundbreaking new invention that if some uniquely talented partners, such as yourselves, could get hold of the parts I need to build it, no questions asked, of course, we could auction this invention off to the highest bidder for, oh, what's the term, uh, Boatload of cash? Wrap it up, honey. How big a boat are we talking? Does the name Titanic ring any bells? Now, input the satellite dish cable into the main power box. This is thine invention that will fetch us untold billions? What's it do? Nothing yet. You see, it needs one last component. Uh, Miss Slomo, if you would please insert your timepiece into the power box. You're out of your mind. Crazy. That is a fruitcake. No way I'm giving this up. You remember our deal, don't you? Uh, I help you, you help me. Yeah, well, if it means giving up this baby, then the deal is off. Overdone. Finito. Yes, it certainly is. <laughs> The name's Swindle. I'm what you might call an intergalactic arms dealer. And thanks to you, I now have in my possession the slickest weapon in the galaxy. This baby's gonna be worth a fortune in the upcoming Decepticon Autobot War. So again, if you don't mind, the timepiece. With the Allspark fragment in the power box. What is this Allspark of which he speaks? Who cares? Let him have it! Time to slow you down. Megatronic force field emitter. A little something I picked up in an arms deal with a Vok of Nexus Zero. Nice creatures, the Vok. If you're ever in the Nexus Zero area, do yourself a favor and check them out. You won't be sorry. Now, I really don't want to have to ask again for that timepiece. You wouldn't risk blasting me and destroying this. Good point. But now... Megatron, you old warmonger! It's been stellar cycles! I can't tell you how tickled I was to learn that my favorite customer was still online! You look great, by the way. Oh, spare me the platitudes, Swindle. How did you get this frequency? A mutual bounty hunting friend provided it in exchange for a weapon or two. Professional scruples prevent me from revealing his name. Scruples? You'd sell your own motherboard to the highest bidder. <laughs> but enough about me. What would you say if I told you I had a machine that could shut down all electromechanical systems? We're talking the perfect weapon to defeat and destroy your Autobot enemies. 
I would say I might be interested if it truly does as you claim. Well, as the vehicle dealers say here on Earth, you can't expect a customer to buy the car without giving it a test drive. So I've arranged a little demo. What's happened? I'm losing power! Are you seeing this? Are you loving this? Every machine, every robot in Detroit, inoperable. I could spring a leak, I'm so excited. Now, picture this. All your enemies completely immobile, totally aware of everything around them, but completely helpless to move or speak. A fate even worse than going offline, eh? Eh? So, do we have a deal or what? This weapon will win the war for you, Megatron. Guaranteed. Uh, of course, we still need to discuss price. Hey, Bolt Brain. Can't touch this. Okay, you shouldn't be moving. Forsooth, two can play at the Force Field game, Knave. Ha ha ha! You have got to be joking! Yeah, and here's the punchline. Uh, uh, wait! Don't you want to negotiate? Yeah, me neither. Hey, where's the off switch on this thing? Oh yeah, right here. We don't know what this Decepticon is capable of. Funny you should mention that. Oh no you don't! Bumblebee! Use caution, Bumblebee. He may still pose a danger. Nah, he's stuck in park for good. Oh, and he's got a flat, too. Well, looks like somebody had a four-for-one sale on small-time crooks. And as for your getaway car, uh, it'll be stripped and sold for parts at police auction. Yeah, should fetch a pretty good price. <laughs> I gotta cut it out. You got Swindle and Blitzwing too? Well, Swindle was stuck in vehicle mode. All I had to do was pay a fine and tow him away. But Blitzy here was something else. We need to discuss compensation. You get freedom, but what do I get? You see where I'm going here? The honor of serving Megatron should be reward enough. Megatron? Why 
Why didn't you say so? The old warmonger's my number one customer. Now, let's see about getting you rearmed. Oh, it's been stellar cycles, but I never forget a weapon. Uh, naturally, everything comes with a million solar cycle warranty, excluding battle damage, of course. May I just say what an admirer I am of the noble arms dealing profession? Enough talk! Let's kick some Autobot skin plate! Yeah! Oh, I would never do that! In the glorious name of Megatron, revenge shall be ours! Did you, Commander? We split the heavy weather scene full and clear. Don't sound so surprised. Better check on the prisoners. You Autobots will pay. Pay with your sparks. I also accept all major credit downloads. The alarms didn't make a beep. How's that even possible? The Sonic Jammer 3000! Don't leave Cybertron without it! But wait! There's more! It also has a stasis suspension ray! Handy for those tight spots! Pick this baby up on Quintessa! Nice folks, the Quintessons! Give you a good deal and all the oil you can drink! All very fascinating, Svindle! But we must crush them into scrap! We need backup! Call Cybertron! And let them know this happened on my watch? I'd rather go offline! That can be arranged! Odd. I'm getting an encrypted message on the emergency sub-frequency. Run it through the filter, boss bot! Broken Lance? It's an old private code from our academy days. Sentinel only used it when he was about to get caught doing something he shouldn't. Sentinel called you for help? He must really be in trouble. Be hasty. You know how hard it is to get decent elite guard spare parts these days? These babies are a gold mine. Hmm. There is a certain logic to keeping them online. You kidding? We could make enough to retire to a beach island on Nebulos, where the energon is as smooth as a protoform's bottom. Not to mention with these four, you have a bargaining chip. Maybe to help you find Megatron. Very well. We will keep these pathetic Autobots online for the glory of Megatron. Brilliant idea. Just brilliant. Oh, of course it's brilliant. It was my idea to begin with. Huh. Never could get the hang of cloning. Why don't you try these on for size? Just so I can tell you bots apart. On the fifth moon of Pazan? Oh. 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 Traitor! How dare you collaborate with Autobots! Collaborate my actuator? This is a private transwarp frequency to my own personal storage dimension, mister! Optimus, attack! What are you waiting for? Better odds. Wait, Optimus! Aren't you gonna free us? Come back here! There's an order! An order! Stay here and guard the prisoners. I shall handle this myself. Guard the prisoners or loot the ship. It's a no process, sir. -er.
Maybe I should help them. Or maybe I should just help myself. Ah, nothing beats a shopping spree. Especially when it's all free! Ha 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 ha!